Grand 11 student so in this video we are going to continue with a partnership so i pick one of the previous question uh, guys so that we can do some transition uh, that you are going to find when you are preparing yourself uh, for june examination okay now we have a ledger account that we are given um, which is capital and we they also give us current account for one partner and they also give us appropriation account and some transaction okay so let's first uh, go through them they said the information general ledger of build it construction um, is a business that owned by mr landman and mr nkosi so they give us a capital for landman um, we have a balance of 350,000 and they give us number A and the balance of 150,000. Then after that, uh, they give us capital account for Nkosi and there is no amount for balance. Then the next one, they give us the current account for Lendman. We don't have a current account for Nkosi. Okay, then the next one, they give us appropriation account. We have some figures that we need to calculate. Okay, so now the transition they said landman contributed a new vehicle with the cost price of 150,000 on 1 september 2018 okay and Nkosi made no change to his capital during the financial year and interest are calculated at 15 percent per annum and on the partner's capital contribution at the beginning of financial year Nkosi received annual salary of 351,000, and this include bonus which is equal to his one month's salary okay then the remaining profit and loss are shared between landman and Nkosi in the ratio of three is to four okay now let's start so guys if you are given letters like this and you somewhere somehow you have a format start with the one that you feel like you know them best for example we have number j number j guys under appropriation account if you know the format of appropriation account you know that on the credit side you only have profit or loss profit or loss okay i was set, just setting example for for this one don't just go through a number a number b c because you will find that some figures they want you to calculate the other one first okay let's look at number a number a guys if you check transaction number one, they, they told us that Landman contributed a vehicle of 150 on 1 September. And if you can check on the ledger, the date is 1 September number A, which means that we are going to record vehicle, vehicle number A. Okay. Then number B, number B is a capital for Nkos. How are we going to calculate this one? They never said anything. Okay. But we know that interest uh, on capital is 15 percent we can do a reverse all right so if you look at uh, number up under appropriation account we have interest on capital which is amount of 109 500 but this interest of cap on, on capital guys is for both partner now we have to find for uh, only so that we can do reverse and and get what a capital amount which means that let's subtract for lendman so that we can remain with Nkosi's interest then we can do versa versa and get our capital okay uh, interest for Nkosi interest on capital for for lendman I mean if you check number E we can calculate it interest in, num in number E we have to calculate number E first. Interest on Lendman. Okay, number E. At the beginning, he have 350 uh, amount of capital. And we know that the interest is only 15%. Then we're going to get amount of 52,500. Alright, now, because we have interest of Lendman, which means that we can subtract it here and left with uh, interest phone calls 52 500 
then we're gonna left with a amount of 57,000 which is interest for phone calls now let's do versa versa because we know that this is 15 percent of capital which means that we can say we are looking for reverse of 100 out of a uh, interest of 15 percent which is going to give us uh, an amount of 38 thousand which means that his capital was 38 because if you say 380 multiply by 15 percent you're gonna get 57 thousand simple like that it's not that difficult in grade 11. okay now let's go to number c number c is a format um we have to ca calculate a salary okay so we just have to rename this is for salary uh, for landman landman or landman whatever that you can see is fine okay next one uh, let's go to number okay number h number h is a format guys number h we need to record a bonus phone calls because he is the only one that have what bonus okay and the other one number i is current account is current account phone calls because for other partner is already there okay now we left with number d okay let's take number d number d d d d is drawings d is drawings and you can see that they, we can just do a balancing figure because we have a total and we know the balance it was twelve thousand, which means that we need to just do a balancing figure because we don't have anything or any other transaction under debit side eight eighty nine thousand minus twelve thousand which is going to give us 7,000 of drawings simple like that all right number e we did it and number f okay let's take number f is under appropriation account current account for lendman f and number transition number five they say the remaining profit or loss are shared between lendman and Kosi at a ratio of three is to four okay then we know that uh, Nkosi got 514. 514. Uh, 514,000. Okay. Nkosi got 514,000. And uh, his ratio was 4. And land man that we are calculating is three, which means that we can say we are looking for three out of four. We can't say out of seven because this is not total. It's portion of of course. Simple. If it's total, you say three over seven. Okay. Then you're gonna get amount uh, of three eighty five five hundred. Okay. Then number G now number g we have to calculate i think is salary phone calls yes salary phone calls okay if you check uh, they said the amount is 351,000, but this amount include one month bonus which means that we can say my blah by we are looking for 12 over 13 then it's gonna give us amount of 324,000. Why we are trying to re to subtract what that one month of a bonus because bonus we need to record it separate. Okay, it was already recorded there as 27,000. Okay, or you can just say this one minus 27,000, it's gonna give you the answer. Okay, now we are looking for. Last one, number J. Before we go to number J, guys, please, 
make sure that you subscribe to this channel so that we can keep recording videos for grade 11 and i know that this channel is assisting you a lot so please do yourself a favor by subscribing so that you can get notification for all videos that are related to grade 11 lesson and enjoy so that you can be ready for your june examination and also guys we already started with our online extra classes that we gonna add you to whatsapp group so that we can teach you i think grade 11 we do a class at half past seven on saturday at night so that we can cover everyone at night so we do online class through the zoom or a telegram so if you want to join us guys it's only six rand make sure that you join so that you can learn so that when you go to grade 12 guys you're gonna have foundation of accounting let's do number one number one number k i mean number k number k they are looking for profit or loss we have to add everything that we have on the debit side okay uh, if you check number one we have 385 500 and we also have 514,000 and we have 324 these two guys they are remaining share this one remember is the one that we calculate this one was already uh, recorded okay and we add the one that we recorded number g 324,000 and the other one that we have is 420,000 plus 27,000 plus 109,000 it's gonna give you 1,780,000 just like that so you have to make sure that you show this calculation guys because marks are like this are like this so i hope you learn and you enjoy go to grade 11 playlist and check other videos so that you can master all kind of different provisions questions so that you can be ready guys don't forget to subscribe and like this video see you